It's really awesome to think about this event finally coming to fruition. It was one of the first things we envisioned as we started this college, and now all of you are joining us as a part of our legacy to establish a culture of innovation and entrepreneurship to solve problems in challenging healthcare environments. Well, I think it's a really exciting way to address the challenges in healthcare that we're facing. Um, it's a short period of time, but I think the pressure of it uh, gives us a great chance for inspiration and to really push through and come up with something great. I think it's really exciting to be able to create a problem that you want to solve and then thoroughly think about a solution and then finally create a product in order to solve that problem. The atmosphere is energetic. It's, uh, it's great to see the ideas these teams are coming up with. It started with the problem pitches on Friday night and seeing the teams build really quickly and come up with some innovative ideas has been, been really fantastic. The idea that my team has come up with, I think it's something that regardless of the results of the hackathon, I think that we will be pursuing after this weekend something that we really want to implement in, in rural communities and here in Spokane. This being a rural health centered event, it brings a level of kind of sober honesty that I think a lot of events that are in healthcare innovation lack. And so um, I've seen people focusing on solving real problems, focusing on real people, and coming up with some really interesting solutions. We think some of these teams have ideas that are viable, that could really take off and, and build a business if that's the path they wanted to pursue. Some of these ideas would be great things just to be open sourced and given away. So I think there's going to be some legs to some of this. And for those that, you know, they walk away and they've learned something that they might come back next year and make an even better event. I would love to do it every year if I could.